Today, my name is Miles Smith of the International Research and Exchanges Board, IRIX. IRIX is an international non-governmental organization that has branches in Turkmenistan and 50 other countries. Here in Turkmenistan, among many of other projects that we do here, is an internet access and training program. And a partner program of that is one that brings Americans and Turkmen together through the internet. And through this program, we've brought three Americans here from the United States, from the state of Pennsylvania. Uh, they will be speaking with us shortly and talking about how they use the internet to connect with partners and other students here in Turkmenistan. This project is funded by the US Department of State and the Educational and Cultural Affairs Bureau of the US State Department. And through this project, we've been able to unite over 100 teachers and students between Turkmenistan and the United States using online forums, online chats, and videos that they share through the internet and by other methods. And today we'll be talking more about how you can use the internet and technology to improve education through interactive methods. Hi, my name is Anna Rubenstein, and I'm from Philadelphia, Pennsylvania in the United States. I'm an 11th grader at a high school called Hapro Horsham. I'm here to help with students here to help introduce technology into their community. We're trying to help share what we know about technology. Our program is funded by the state, U.S. State Department. The organization is called IREX, and we try to help inter integrate different cultures so we can learn about each other. And one part of it is that we're trying to help show what we know about technology, and that's just a small part of what we're doing here. There's one program called Tech Age Girls that the organization hosts for girls all throughout Turkmenistan, and what they, they go through different trainings, and that is all narrowed down to 15 girls that have made it through the training, and they get to come to Ashgabat here, and they get to learn technology. We are trying to help by teaching them some things that we know that we have learned back in the U.S. I personally am very involved with Photoshop and we are also teaching them about Google applications that they can use online. So we're trying to show them how the internet is very useful and it's used in education a lot um, back in America and we are trying to introduce them to what options they have out there. Uh, we are trying to help them understand what, what technology can do for them. I'm very excited to be here in Turkmenistan because I really didn't know much about the culture and I'm very happy to say that everyone here is very nice and I love the area, it's beautiful here and it's just very different than anything I've ever seen and I'm very glad to have come. My name is Jim Shields. I am a high school technology teacher from Happer Horsham High School in Horsham, Pennsylvania. And I am here in Turkmenistan to learn about Turkmenistan culture as part of a cultural exchange program. The United States State Department funded our trip here. And it's an honor to be here in Turkmenistan to learn about Turkmenistan culture and to have the opportunity to share some of my technology knowledge with the students of Turkmenistan. I have a little bit to give to those students, but I feel that I'm taking a lot more um, back to the United States um, from Turkmenistan. It's been a pleasure to work with all of the students, um, especially the tech age girls. They have been a pleasure to work with, and um, the students are extremely motivated. And my impression of a Turkmenistan student um, is that they are very strong students and they care about education um, so much that it's inspiring to me as a teacher. I wish that uh, my students in the United States were as motivated and caring as the tech age girls and Turkmenistan students. So this program that I'm here with is a culture exchange. Um, it's funded by the U.S. State Department, but everything is coordinated through an organization 
known as IREX, located here in Ashgabat. They have been coordinating all of the events that we have um, been partaking in, and the Turkmen people have been extremely friendly and warm and kind to us, me and, and the two students that I'm here with, and it's been a great experience, and my impression of Turkmenistan is very good. Um, I would love to come back here, and I would love for students or teachers in Turkmenistan to visit our high school in the United States. Um, I would like to treat them as nicely as they've treated us. Hi, my name is Kenny Pallas. I'm a student from Horsham, Pennsylvania. I go to Happer Horsham High School. I will be a senior next year. And uh, I was lucky enough to get selected by uh, IREX to travel to Turkmenistan for an uh, exchange to learn about the Turkmenistan culture and to hopefully share my knowledge of technology with some of the students and teachers. Uh, I've really enjoyed it so far. It's been an eye-opening experience and none of it would have been possible without the United States State Department who helped fund us the, to get here. And um, I've, some of the things I've been able to do so far is talk to uh, and work with the tech age girls who are some teenagers from around Turkmenistan that are working on to better their technology skills and to improve their lifestyle. And uh, I've really enjoyed what I've seen so far. It's been very eye-opening to see some of the architecture and differences between the two cultures. I think it's been a great experience. And I hope other students like from the United States will get the same experience.